Hi, in this video we are going to see how to test the inductor in the laptop motherboard. So we are gonna see first the types of inductor as you can see here and then we are going to test it. So as you can see this is a laptop motherboard where we have many types of inductor. So basically the inductor contain two pins okay, or two terminals. So as you can see, we have many types of inductor. So this is a small inductor near to the power jack. So we have the reference is L or we always L means inductor or coil. Okay. Here we have other types of inductor. This is SMD inductor. We have PL. So L or PL is a reference for inductor in the laptop motherboard. So this is inductor, not capacitor. So this is inductor. Okay, you should pay attention. We have PL and those are capacitor. Okay, so this is inductor also, as you can see. Over here we have another inductor. So this yellow component is a current sense resistor. So over here near to the battery connector, as you can see, we have capacitors and inductors. So these two component is asymptote inductor and those are ceramic capacitors. So now we are gonna use the multimeter to test these coils on our inductor, we are gonna select the diode option or the, or the continuity option or buzzer option. So the inductor should have a low resistance. Okay, basically the inductor is like a fuse. Okay, so let's now check these inductors. So let's begin with this first. We have two terminals. Let's use the multimeter probe and check the resistance as you can see 007 or 8. So this is a low resistance, means the inductor is good. If you find that the inductor doesn't give to you any reading, means the inductor is bad. So let's check this also using the multimeter, of course. So we have 006, means the inductor is good. So these two inductors is for the processor, as you can see. So over here, we have other types of inductors. These black inductors always the same working principle. So here, this is the 3 volt, 5 volt power circuit. So let's check again. So we should get a low resistance, as you can see in the multimeter. Okay, always for this, so the, those inductors are good, so let's see other inductors, so here, in the back of the motherboard, as you can see, we have SMD inductors, as you can see, the same, low resistance, means good, those are capacitors, as you can see, as you can see, and this is inductor. We have 002, a very low resistance. This also is inductor, as you can see, the low resistance in the multimeter. Over here, we have other inductor, as you can see. So this is the way, the method that you should use to test inductors. You should just use the continuity option in the multimeter and for those this is ceramic capacitors so here we have another type of inductor this blue inductor as you can see basically this contains four pins okay four pins or terminals as you can see we have here two and we have other here but all pins are connected together so this is inductor also so always in every circuit in the motherboard you will find inductors and capacitors. Okay? And of course we use sometimes the inductors to detect the short circuit. And over here we have this kind of inductor like a fuse near to the power jack as you can see. So let's check it. We should find a low resistance in the multimeter as you can see.
so the inductor is good okay